Matthew Pritchard is a professional skateboarder, stuntman, celebrity chef and endurance athlete, but above all that is one of my heroes. They say never meet your heroes, but if your heroes aren't worth meeting then they shouldn't be your heroes in the first place. I didn't do too much filming on this one because I didn't want to just jam a camera in the man's face, but he cooked up a vegan treat from his cookbook, we slurped some bevies and we had a wonderful time. Enjoy. And here we are, louts on a mountain, three louts, one mountain, with my boy, Sir Matthew of Pritchard, and the main, the main man, yeah, Lemmy. Ah, Lemmy! There he Turn is. Back to the camera, Lem. You know, awesome. Say hello. Right, here we go, we're going to get some tea on the go. Pritch is going to, well Pritch is going to do all the cooking, aren't you? It's a recipe from the cookbook, the vegan cookbook, Dirty Vegan. Link below, I'll leave it downstairs and you can have a look if that's your thing, if you're vegan. Even if you're not and you want to get into it, it's a great book. I've done a couple of recipes off it myself. I fully recommend it. We're going to use pasta instead of polenta because all cookbooks are just guides. You can add your own little things to them if you choose to. The new titanium. Titanium bush box. Shout out Matt Morgan for getting me this. Oh, look at these oyster mushrooms. You can make a good... Are they oysters? You can make... Oh, there's a mixture of finister... Uh, chestnut... Shiitake. You can make some good uh, Kentucky Fried vegan chicken. Or yeah. Stay. Tell it's nice Stay. because the gills go down the stem. Not unlike most mushrooms. Stay. Fun fact as They're well. They're so meaty in these, these shiitake mushrooms. Are just... They are. Fun fact about oyster mushrooms is they're not vegan. Huh? They eat insects. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they work with kids and animals unless it's Lemmy. Then do. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we've not I, ab I absolutely love mushrooms, they are banging. In it. I've just watched the documentary about on Netflix fungi, about mushroom fungi. Because yeah, yeah. when you're cooking in the outdoors, leave no trace. There you go. Leave no trace. Even <laughs> if we all know mushrooms and onions and garlic, they all come from the ground. Leave no trace. Don't leave. Don't leave a mess. There you go. You've heard that's the, that's from the horse's mouth. <laughs> there you go. And there we are, lash rooms. We're getting really cooked for. For those that don't know, um, Pritch had a, a a proper cooking show on telly. A vegan cooking show on telly. And a proper vegan to boot. We know, like, this is, this is kind of a privilege to be cooked for. I think for. it was the, it was, it was the first uh, vegan cooking show to be aired in the UK. The f On BBC Wales. There you go. The first vegan. Check me out. <laughs> dirty vegan. I mean, here we go. It's a privilege, an absolute privilege. To, to Dude, to do an onion like that in the air is it's brave and stupid it's quite sketchy which is i'm doing it two of the things that would be used probably be on your <laughs> tombstone to be fair here lies preach brave and stupid he's been taking piss out of my accent all day all day which is fair dues i'm not i'm not taking the piss i actually really like it it's just it, when i, it's when been I a hang shock out with people with a different accent they only end up talking just just like them. <laughs> 
It's, this is the Welsh Yorkshire collaboration that you didn't know you needed. I cooked the pasta earlier. Life's too short to, yeah. be, to not be cooking pasta earlier. And we're going to cook it on the new titanium bush box. And if you're wondering why I'm cutting everything in the air, it's because we forgot the chopping board. We did. You could use that as a chopping board if you if you, you know what? if you had to. Adapt and overcome. Adapt and overcome. And that's Bushcraft 101. And that's what I'll be telling Ray next week. Yeah, Ray. Oh, you're going to go see <laughs> Uncle Ray, in here. Yeah. That's what we call him, Uncle Ray. That's from a story back in the day, which I'm not going to get into. Glowing it that. Right, Matthew, where are we at now with this? We got the um, we got the onions in, we got the celery in, uh, just um, sweating them down. We're now adding a selection of mushrooms. And I'm downwind of it, and let me tell you, it smells Ooh. delightful already. I'm going to reduce these though. I didn't want to put the garlic in first because if the garlic burns, it'll get bitter. This is one one pan cooking for camping. Perfect. Yeah. Simple. Yeah. The secret to cooking is keep it simple. You can't go wrong. But Hazy said about doing this with me, he said, where should we go? Well, this place where we're at now, I've been coming up Penavan watching sunrise and sunsets and coming up here for quite a number of years. And I've always looked down at this spot and said, one day I'll camp here. And uh, when he said he's going to come down, he said, oh, do you fancy going out camping and doing some stuff? I was like, yeah, 100%, man. Where should we go? I was like, finally. Yes. We can go to this spot, and I said, well, i got this spot. Uh, yep, sounds good to me. And now we're uh, the sun's just going down. We're cooking food. We're having a glass of uh, red wine. There's happy days. Happy days, mate. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. The big pond next to us. What more can you want? It's natural, isn't it? it is Life natural. is good, boy. Is, Life is it good. It is, boy. And I'm going to come back <laughs> talking about boy and being Welsh myself. I love it. This is Matt's spoon, Whittle. Oh, get the focus, there we go, with his logo. Sleep when you're dead. Long handle spoon. Brilliant stuff. Bush crafty. There we go. We're gonna add some oh. white wine. Yes, man. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Reduce that down now. Let's get some flavour in yet. Get some more flaming on go. Let's get some, turn the heat up to reduce the wine. Look at that. Pretty as a picture. Look at that. If they aren't earthy colours, then what are? Let's get some salt and pepper in. No, I'm not. <laughs> if anyone, oh, wait a minute. Not, I'm not. <laughs> wait a minute. Oh, I didn't this, is, this is salt, boy. Oh. Get the boombox on. We're away. <laughs> Whee! Beautifully seasoned. It, the smells coming off here are sublime. It's all right. <laughs> Honestly, stay. <laughs> then he's having one on. He's, he's, got, he's, he's on one because Tom's are coming out. Reduce down. No, we're gonna add some chopped tomatoes. Yes, boy. I love it more flavour to the sauce, man. I'd say half a tin. Yeah, I'm not here to tell you. What to do? But this is what no, this is what, this is what I this is what I do. So if you if you like it, then we were just talk. We were just talking, and uh, 
we were saying that there is some people that say, oh yeah, we can't do anything on a vegan, a vegan diet. This man here is proof that you can. Because... I mean, I can't even begin to go through the... Uh, what have you done there? I've just put a sprig of thyme in. A sprig of thyme in there. And now we're going to add some veg stock. And veg stock. Make sure it's on paper. But as we're saying, this man defies all that because... I mean, I'm not going to go through the whole list of stuff that he's done. But just... I mean, I've done an Iron Man, so I know how hard it is. This man did an Iron Man every day for 10 days. So I can't even begin to imagine that. And he did that fully vegan. And I've just added some veg stock as well. Right, veg stock in there. So I've put, I've put some thyme in. I've added some nice dark veg stock. Oh. And now I'm just going to... Let me stand. <laughs> yeah, this, this is a cooking yeah. show. We've got we, a dog we, to deal with as well. <laughs> Let me. We're not going to leave you in here. Let me daddy kiss. Eh? Yeah, I love you. I He's love, adorable. Love Absolutely adorable. And this makes our wild camping cooking show even more wholesome. Is that we have a dog on board. Reduce this down now. Get some more flavour. Like and then we'll add the pasta. Mix it in. All right, good. Then we pull the time up. And we're good to go. Would we put any Tubby Toms in it? Do you think? Death or is that good too? idea? Shall we? A little bit. Yes. A pinch of it. Yes, 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 yes. Right, let me grab a pinch. Go and get. Go, go and get, get the Tubby Tom. Tom yeah. When I'm cooking. Oh, have a whiff. There she Ladies is. Ladies and right. gentlemen, Tubby yeah. Toms absolutely rocks. Yeah. There well, you. Go. Shout we... out Tubby Tom. How much do you reckon? I've been using him a while. Uh, Hang on, let's yeah, just go with it. I that. mean, it's strong as shit, and it put a bit on your tongue and rub it on your gums. No, it's alright. Go on. My, t my Sanchez needs help. Ah, <laughs> she's got in my eye! <laughs> <laughs> she can blow up my finger into my eye! <laughs> oh, fuck! <laughs> Honestly, fuck it, fuck me! Ah! No. <laughs> I'm serious! <laughs> Dude, it's fucked. Oh, really? It's, honestly, it, it's come off my finger, it's gone in my eye. Yes. <laughs> you ah. Sometimes the game pulls you back in. When you're and cooking in the wild, watch the wind and Tubby Tom's. There you go. Tubby shit. Tom's death dust, wind and eyeballs. Back in the day, they'd done that for banter. This time, <laughs> it, was, it, was, it, was, it was an accident. Let me have a taste, let me have a taste of this. Taste it. What she like? Whoa, that's good. And you know what? I put just the right amount of Tubby, Tubby Tom Jess dust because that's powerful, man. I tell you what. Oh, I'm not joking. That's. Tubby, you, do you like hot stuff? I do, yeah. Cool. You're right there. Tubby Tom's, but Tubby Tom's turns up, doesn't he? He, he turns up. Whoa, man. Is it spicy? That... <laughs> no, we got shell pasta. Here we go, Michelle so Obama. Because it, it, it cups in the, the sauce. Oh, it does, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That's a lot of gear. So maybe we should have put half in. No. no maybe we right. should have. Maybe we should have gone easy on the pasta. Well. Sod it. It's in now. It's in. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> what a good. dish, man. What a dish. It looks good. Oh, what a feeling. <laughs> when we're on. eating pasta on the ceiling. <laughs> yes. But what happens is all the sauce goes in the shells. You can see it in goes there, Michelle yeah. Obama. It's just in there. Now, the Brits, when they cook pasta with sauce, they use loads of sauce. But the Italians make pasta just to uh, make pasta sauce just to coat the pasta. Yeah, because their pasta is better. I think. Their yeah. It's pretty as a picture. Ladies and gentlemen, I introduce to you. Pritchard's Mushroom Ragu... Oh. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, introduce to you Pritchard's Mushroom Ragu with pasta there outside you. in the wild of the Brecon Beacons National Park. There Let's you. get tucked in hazy days. Yes, man. Yes, man. Right, let me just have a little taste on cam and then we're going to turn oh, you off, then. guys, and then we're going to just get stuck in. There she is. A bit of everything on there. Tomato, onion, mushroom, pasta. 
<laughs> yes, man. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you what as well. I got one of them uh, them oysters. The the texture of that oyster is beautiful. And Tubby Tom, you've outdone yourself. Spicy, but if he'd have put another pinch or two in there, it might have been a bit too much. <laughs> that was perfect. The pinch that didn't go in there went in his eye, and I'm glad it did. <laughs> <laughs> Happy days, man. So we're just going to get stuck into this. Yeah, bosh, man. Nice one. Unless something magic or tragic happens. See you on the morrow. Morning glampers. We're up early, early doors. It's about half five. The cloud has come down over these tops. It's enveloping us, look at it. A moody morning. We're going to go and have a little dunk in there and blow away the cobwebs. We didn't get super pissed, but I feel it. I feel it in my noggin. So we're going to go and have a little dip, aren't we, just to wash our... Wakey, wakey! <laughs> wakey, wakey, rise and shine. Fresh as a <laughs> Careful that them rocks are sharp as well. And slippy. Stay there, <laughs> What are you getting, boy? Stay, let me. Oh, woo -hoo. Nah. Wicks, wicks, cloudy, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I'll get one more. Hold on. Let <laughs> me got bags on. <laughs> God, that fucking stinks! <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> wakey, wakey! Welcome to Wales! <laughs> oh, we're deep in Wales now! Yeah. Oh, my heck, it's cold, isn't it? It's cold! This is... This is the life of my life! <laughs> Beautiful! Oh, beautiful. Most people are in bed. Beautiful. Whoa. That's the one, Nabby. Did it? Oh. God, my skin's tingling. Ah, oh, there's no better, man. There's no better. There's no better. Ah, yes. <laughs> that is it. Back in the game. Woo! There we are, as always, leave no trace. Even Lemmy's carrying his water bottle out. And we may be way up there in the ankle. We'll maybe leave get a no bit of... trace. There we go. From the man himself. <laughs> and we might get a bit of a sunrise from up tops. It's still early doors. Happy days. Bonnie, that in here. There we go. Fade to black. Fade to black. Thanks for watching.